610 right now. Tonight, a Charlotte theater group is offering a free performance uptown for anyone who donates to the Nine Food Drive. WSOC partnered with Second Harvest Food Bank to keep children from going hungry in our community. Tonight, a group will perform Be a Lion, which is a spinoff of the 1978 film The Wiz. And the first 150 people who donate canned or non-perishable food will get in for free. Doors open at 630. The performance is at 7 o'clock at Duke Energy Theater at Spirit Square. That's on North College Street. You can also drop off non-perishable and canned foods at any show Mars. Ashley Home Store, Hendrick Honda, or ER Plumbing. NightFoodDrive.com has all the details. A Charlotte man. Good afternoon, I'm Channel 9, Stephanie Maxwell outside the Channel 9 studios for the 9 Food Drive. I'm so overwhelmed right now. Look behind me. All of this donation that you're seeing right here, we got all of that in the last five minutes. You really have stepped up to the plate. We want to mention the cast to be a lion. They're here. It's loose, uh, basically a loose... Uh, on the Wiz, and they were here. They're bringing donations. We want to thank them for participating in the Channel 9 Food Drive. We're here till 7 o'clock. We here at Channel 9 are very grateful to our viewers because of all the generous donations you brought to our studio today. People dropped off everything they could to help feed 188,000 children in the Charlotte area who might not have lunches this summer without it. Eyewitness News anchor Stephanie Maxwell shows us how even the smallest members of our community pitched in to help. Just look at all of this food right here. The truck was empty when we started the collection, and now you can see it's full. I need we'll somebody to Oh, we got a ton of stuff. Every one of those cans is going to feed somebody tonight. We saw the youngest children trying to help, including a girl carrying a bag nearly as big as she is. The crew from Be a Lion took a unique approach, offering a free performance as long as people brought a can or box of food. Why not reach out to the audience and say, hey, listen, help us with this food drive? And they did, and they came through big, majorly. Michael Harris says his job working with the homeless at a drug rehab center inspired him to donate for the first time. That there's a lot of folks out there that just don't have. Harrisburg firefighters saw our tweets and within hours went on a huge shopping spree. As soon as we said, hey, it's just something you guys want to get in on. They were breaking out their wallets. Thank you so much. Great afternoon. Thank Throughout you. the day, the motivation to help was the same. I just want to do my part. I wanted to do just my little part. But one message really touched us from 11-year-old Ava Rosenquist, who asked for food donations instead of birthday presents. I wanted to help the people instead of helping myself because I thought I, they needed more than I did. Stephanie Maxwell, Channel 9 Eyewitness News. So sweet. Well, that food is going straight to Second Harvest Food Bank's warehouse to be sent out to 700 partner agencies, all to feed the hungry. It is not too late for you to donate. You can drop off food at all of these locations through this Sunday. Families across the Charlotte area have you to thank because of that helping hand to feed their children. Yeah, that's because many of you donated to the Nine Food Drive yesterday in North Charlotte. One donation that really touched us was an 11-year-old girl who asked for food donations for her birthday instead of presents. And the reason she did it was even more moving. I wanted to help the people instead of helping myself because I thought I, they needed more than I did. Wow, if you could not make it out, you can still donate at these locations through Sunday. You can find more information at 9fooddrive.com.